Hi guys, so I'm gonna, wait, I missed. Hey guys, what's going on here? I am in Bentley's garage right now. We are here with the BMW i8 Roadster. This just came out. Um, this car is absolutely incredible. Um, we got the flying buttresses right here, the electronic and gas powered engine. Um, I'm not really sure about where everything is at in the car. This is my first time actually seeing an i8 Roadster. I saw one that was black on the road a few days ago. That was really cool, but this is my first time up close and personal seeing everything, like how the roof is put together. This actually looks like textile material that's in one of my Volvos. Um, really cool, very uh, <laughs> water resistant. But yeah, um, HRE wheels on this. Um, these are really, really cool. All right, so we are in the Bentley. Not the Bentley we are in the <laughs> i8 with Bentley right now, and uh, he's gonna teach me how to get around the car and uh, all the buttons and stuff like that. Yeah. So, what do I need to know? So you can, um, if you press this down. If I press this. Take a look right so here. you um, press this thing down. Uh huh. Look up. Oh, oh, everything's happening right now. Yeah. The roof is coming off. The roof is coming off. Oh. That's really cool. So now we're in a spider. Yeah, this is not a spider, but it's a, it's a roadster. There's so many different names for um, drop tops. There's a spider, there's roadster, there's target top. This is actually like a target top, like in the Porsche. Yeah. It has like a cloth roof. Yeah. And uh, like a glass back window. Did you know um, how to um, turn on Max? Like, like air control which the max the, <laughs> the ac i think it's already on it's not even on it's not on ac is not a going. little bit are we in drive um are we in sport how, do you know how to change the modes like the drive modes right here so we're in drive you knock it over in yeah. the sport oh the engine comes on when you put it in the yeah, sport because that means when, whenever the car um like drives and like sport it, it's gas it's a gas and electric no but on Eco Pro is mixed. Oh, okay. So that's Eco Pro is gas and electric. You can do just gas, gas yeah. and electric, and just electric. But if you're on gas mode, that means the car will charge itself. Yeah, with the regenerative braking. Yeah. That's a pretty cool feature. Yeah, and. Anything else I should know about? These cup holder placements are kind of wonky. Yeah. Can you sit in the back seat? No. <laughs> 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 But there's speakers back here. I know. That's pretty cool. And if you press that button. This button? Yeah, it will open the door. The door's open up? I'm not gonna, is it gonna hit the bush? I don't, I'm not gonna open it up all the way. Hey, the get away, buggy. Get away. <laughs> Can we go for a spin? I need to drive around a little bit. All right. So now we're gonna drive. Yeah, now we're gonna drive. And this I, is gonna be sick. Guys, this is my first time driving a BMW i8. I've driven the BMW X5M, I've driven the BMW M4 GTS, and that's about it. I've only driven two BMWs before this. What do you think about that? What? Um, yeah. The M4 GTS was insane. Sounded amazing. Probably one of the best cars I've ever driven, so we'll see how this is. What about Bugatti? I have driven a Bugatti. That was insane. What kind of Bugatti? I drove the Veyron. The McLaren's... 720? Not that one. 570? No. <laughs> oh, Senna. The Senna, yeah, that's really cool. Even the... The Veyron. Yeah, the Veyron. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's just low, you should be okay. On miles per hour, on Bugatti Veyron, and on Super Sport uh -huh. Veyron, and T-Ron, so on miles per hour, on T-Ron is 261. Yeah. And Super Sport, for some reason, faster than Red Door T-Ron. Because it's 268 miles per hour. Oh, yeah. It can actually go 300. The Chiron can go 300. No, it's over 300, 400. Kilometers. Yeah. But did you know on kilometers, um, on kilometers, um, the, the, the Devil 16 is 536. 500, does that actually drive? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> the Devil 16. So do you watch a lot of car videos on YouTube? Yeah, you can search them. Uh-huh. And, and uh, what made you want to start a channel on YouTube? Well, I 
I usually like watch cars and uh -huh. like learn about them. And you wanted to do your own thing. Yeah. And I. Ah! Oh damn! What? This thing only has 450 horsepower. Really? How much torque does this have? This thing sounds pretty good when you step on it. Yeah. Oh. Oh my God! You <laughs> dropped my dad's phone. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll just put that right back up. It's more secure. I don't think it was locked in all the way. Yeah. All right. Hmm. They should put like the thing sticking up there, so it's like these brakes are very touchy. You know, it, it's it's a lot driving a new car. You know, since you haven't driven, <laughs> you still have to wait ten years before you can drive. How does that sound? I'm only seven years old. Oh, set. You're seven, so you have to wait. Yeah, around nine, eight, nine years. Nine years? Oh, yeah, to experience this. Yeah, I have to be six Oh, wow. Wow, how do you like that? Do you like the sound? What, what's your favorite part about the driving experience or being in the passenger seat? What's your favorite part about the cars? You like silent cars? Yeah. You like Teslas? Yes. Oh, wow. Have you ever been in a Tesla? Didn't your dad have a Tesla, an X for a little bit? No. no. No, I thought he did. But did you know, when is the Tesla 2.0 coming out? The Tesla 2.0? Yeah. You know? No, I have no idea when new Teslas. I don't stay um, up to date with Teslas. Yeah. I'm mostly a... What are you thinking you're doing? I'm reversing, because I wasn't going to go on the highway. Wow, does that sound real? Because <laughs> you know, in some BMWs, they put like a fake sound in the uh, speaker yeah. system. I know, that's actually the, this one is two. This one two. This one two, you know what I mean? Yeah, because it, it sounds a little, a little manufactured. But... It only does that when it's electric. Oh, okay. So, how do I go into electric mode? Do you know how to do that? So, I'm in sport, um, so I'll just put it into drive. That puts it into e-boost. So, we're in electric right now. Yeah, level Eco Pro. Eco Pro. That's Eco Pro. And this is both? Yeah. C-Mix. It, uh, it feels a lot slower than just sport mode. I know. But, miles per hour on this one is 160 on... On two meters on this one is 260. Oh, wow. Guys, the BMW i8. It's actually a pretty fun car to drive. It's, um, I would say it's a, a daily luxury driver. This thing is not even an electric car. I would, you don't think this is a luxury? What's your, what's your definition of a luxury this car? This thing is a sport, not a luxury. I would say this is a sport luxury. There's no such thing as a sport luxury. I think i8 just came out with it, and it's this. Just kidding, there it is. <laughs> Mercedes, Mercedes I would say is sport luxury with the AMG yeah. and all that. What was half sport? Half sport, half sport. Bye bye Mr. Robo. I was like gonna wave this guy up. You wanna put the roof on because it's starting to get cold hot oh hot so how do we put the roof on all right guys the roof is going up right now Yay. <laughs> bye bye roofy oh this is great <laughs> oh that's really cool so guys um Yay. like in mclaren's the back can go down so when we knock it into sport you can do this and you can still get like the full exhaust note while the roof is on. Let's get this. Oh, the, e the, the you're right. It wasn't on. The AC wasn't on. Let's put it on the auto. Rich, you know him? Yeah. He must be pretty rich to have a Lamborghini Aventador because he has the S. He has the new one that just came out. I know. I've seen the Aventador S before. Have you been in one? No. No. What, what cars have you been in? What's your favorite car? Uh huh. Do you like the Urus? Do you like yeah. SUVs? Yeah, but did you know you can put this like upgrade that you can put a TV on there? Yeah.
Yo, yeah, yeah, in the back. You can actually play like Mario Kart on it too if you like link up a system. But I want the TV and, the, and my dad still didn't even install it. Well, he didn't get that option. I wanted that option. <laughs> tell you, when your dad specs cars, you should tell him to mark all the options. <laughs> <laughs> you should You should go in and start ticking boxes for him. But did you know um, the, the, the future Lamborghini, yeah. they run out already? Yeah, they only made uh, 63? Yeah. And the, are you talking about the Cyan or the SVJ? They didn't even run out the SVJ. Yeah, oh yeah, they're making, they have to sell the Roadsters next. Yeah. I'm looking for like the future one, but not like the, the one that you want for. The one that you're first talking about. The Cyan? Yeah, the, that one's, uh, is, does that, that one has, that one's like half electric, right? It has like a, tor uh, like s something, something. Like that kind of Lamborghini or something? Yeah. How yeah. could a Lamborghini be electric if it is not, oh my goodness, look at that tree. Yeah, it's really red. Um, yeah, yeah I know, right? Lamborghinis, that's like not part of their, uh, their thing. But they came out with the Terzo Millennio. Have, have you seen that car? Um, no. It's fully electric. Nope, it's fully electric. So can you put, put gas in there? Nope. Why don't we put gas in there inside the electric place? I think it would just go all over the ground. I think it would just explode. It might, it, yeah, it might fry like a circuit board or something like that, but... Yeah. <laughs> they don't have every car in the world, but... No, they don't. They definitely don't. Do you like Mag as a dealership? Yeah. Do you like going there and looking at all the new cars? Yes, and my dad bought nine cars from there. Oh, yeah. I've only bought two cars from there. I know, but how much cars do you have? How many cars do I have? Yeah. I have two Volvos. I have a 2016 Volvo S60 and a 2019 Volvo S60. They're worth about the same as this car. Is that the only normal cars you have? I only, I'm only 20. <laughs> I still have a lot of work to do. But do you still have to sell a car and then you will get a exotic car? Um, no, I, I don't plan on selling cars. I plan on keeping my cars and buying cars. I don't, I don't want to have to sell cars. But you have to save your money. Yeah, true, true. I do need, I do need some wealth management training. <laughs> I'm not even 20 yet. <laughs> Are you in, uh, what, what school are you in? Are you in first, second grade? First. First grade. How, is that, and you go into second grade next year? Um, yes. And you're already in these crazy cars? Yes. This is great. In 2020, I'll be in second grade. Uh-huh. What do you want your first car to be? My first car is going to be a, like, the, the Bugatti, uh, the newest Bugatti that comes out after the show, the Bugatti. Devo. Yeah. Did you tell your dad that? Not yet. <laughs> Should we park back up? Park up what? In your driveway. Okay. We need a. And we're gonna go tell your dad that you want a Bugatti Devo. He's going to have to park this up for me. Park what up? <laughs> He's going to have to put this in the garage. Oh, wow. I'm, I you watched know, your videos before this. Oh, that's heavy. And so you can't put anything right here, but you can put stuff right but here. no suitcase. No suitcases right here, but you can put suitcases What's right that here. Thing? This is a license plate holder for the front. We don't use that. This is, do you know what this is? Uh, a screwdriver? This is a tow hook. So if your car breaks down, um, you see, um, I don't know, there might be the panels up front, but there's like a panel you can knock out and it screws in and you can tell the car. E-drive. E-drive. This license plate is not even on the front yet. 